YouTube. Today I spent like 87 hours shopping for a prom dress. No, I'm just kidding. Um, I spent about two hours more, maybe, maybe three, I don't know, with my sister shopping for a prom dress and finally she found one. Um, I will insert a photo. I bought some things in the process of our day-long excursion for this prom dress. I'll just show you what I got. I'll start off with this guy. And I don't usually buy myself stuffed animals anymore, but I could not pass this one up. This is a Pomeranian. And if any of you know anything about anything, if you guys know about the cutest dog in the world, I guess that's a proven fact. I'm not exactly sure. But it is Boo, the Pomeranian. Um, he's had a few picture books out. Um... If you are a fan of him on Facebook, they post pictures every day. He does not have an Instagram. He might have a Twitter. I don't know. But I will put like his Wikipedia and his other links down below if you would like to check him out. But this is Boo. I am a huge Pomeranian lover because I have one. So I know who he is. And when I saw this, I was like, oh my god. Like, it's not just a dog that looks like Boo, it is the actual Boo. This was 20 bucks, but I don't care. I mean, the last time I bought myself a stuffed animal, I don't even know. Um, probably like four years ago. First thing I spotted, and I kept thinking about it the entire time, I was at the mall and I had to go back and get them. And then where my sister bought her dress, the store called Deb. And I was in there forever, like I said, so I had a lot of time to look around. This necklace, it's one of those necklaces that doesn't have a latch. And this is what it looks like up close. It's just braided beads, and it has this one, like, clear little bead. I'm not exactly sure. But when I wear it, I'll probably wear that so it's like in the middle. But yeah, it's just a long necklace, easy to put on. I don't have to deal with any clasps and any of that bullshit. The necklace was eleven fifty. This shirt was fifteen fifty. It's just basically a V-neck T-shirt. And it's very, very sheer, as you can see me through there. Neon orange zebra print, and like I just thought it would be nice in the summer with a tank down underneath. And this was another zebra print, Z zebra designed, I guess, I don't know, thing. It was on sale for 10 bucks. It's very sequiny. As you can see, it's got like sequins and then it goes further down. It's got like the zebra print on there. I don't have anything sequiny, so I thought that would just be cool. And it was 10 bucks, so whatever. I went to a TJ Maxx and I found this because I love these things. I have the regular, like, Palm Perfect. And this is something I've never seen before. It's the Palm Perfect Pixie. Just an electric shaver thingy. It was $6.99, so yeah, I just got that. There was a kiosk in the mall that sells designer perfumes and colognes. And I went to ask him if he has or if he's heard of the Michael Kors Suede Limited Edition fragrance because. I smelled the Inner Cosmo and I fell in love. The only places that I'm finding it 
are online and it's like Macy's and Sephora and they're very expensive. So then I asked him if he had any Versace and specifically I was looking for the Yellow Diamond Versace that just came out but that's another new one. The only places that had that is Macy's and Sephora. Yeah, I may smell Versus by Versace. Never heard of it. So I smelled it and it's amazing. This is the box. I hope I don't blind you. Oh, but okay. I didn't even get to the best part. I asked him about this fragrance. And then he had me smell this one. And I liked it. But I left that booth with nothing in my hands to buy or whatever. And then when I went to TJ Maxx, I found this. And I was like, oh my god, I just smelled that like... A couple hours ago. It was on clearance for $20. I don't know why. Um, but I checked it out. And everything was intact in the box. It wasn't empty or anything. After I checked it out. I was like fuck yeah. I'm going to buy this. I mean I didn't understand why it was on clearance. It wasn't leaking or anything. And here is the bottle. It's got fingerprints on it now from me. But. It is amazing, and I am horrible with notes of what's, you know, like, what fragrances smell like. doesn't say on here, but I'll put it in the description bar if you're interested in what the notes are. It's just, oh my god, it's so good, and I feel like... Is perfect for right now in the spring almost summer. I'll put more details in the description box for you. I didn't buy anything beauty related. I mean perfume clothes are kind of beauty related but I there was no um, makeup stores around me like Sephora or Ulta. I will put a photo of my sister in her dress at the end the video. I'm also going to include a little thing that I took on my iPhone um, of my sister going down a ramp in the mall that we were just at. Just a little FYI, um, if not all of you are aware of this, I am in a wheelchair and so is my sister. You guys might not know that but she is going down the ramp in a wheelchair is fun if you haven't done it um i encourage you all to try thanks for watching this video and i'll talk to you all later bye hey don't hit me okay come down <laughs> Wee. Hi. Bye. Okay, bye.